very bougie to look at, that's for sure. Similar to Kanye, they've got more of a older, beat up looking HAC. Not sure where Kendall Jenner is going, but it looks like she could be going to like the airport or something. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Jess. If you love shopping and handbag videos, please like and subscribe to my channel. I would super appreciate it. All your subscriptions help me grow my channel. So thank you so much. I always like looking at celebrity throwback photos of celebrities wearing designer bags. And I especially love when they wear Hermes bags. I just love seeing the perspective of like what bags used to be in fashion like 10 years ago, five years ago, what are celebrities wearing today. And I guess as a society, we've always been idolizing celebrities, you know, seeing what they're wearing. Brands definitely gift things to celebrities are able to wear the most desirable pieces of clothing in the world and thus I think they are people that we look up to sometimes in fashion and it's good to see like what they wear in their everyday life. I've collected a few images of celebrities who have worn really massive Hermes bags which I just feel like are so different from what you would see in I don't know, our everyday lives. I think it's really cool to look back on massive Hermes bags that celebrities used to wear and even some of these celebrities are still seen wearing these bags like around these days. So first bag I wanted to talk about is the HAC bag. Um, now I just googled a little bit of a history about the HAC bag from Hermes and it was designed in the 1800s and it predates the Birkin bag which uh, the Birkin bag came out in the 80s so definitely the Birkin bag has elements of the HAC in it especially like uh, this part of the bag definitely looks a little bit like a HAC, however, the HAC proportions are a little bit different. And I've noticed a few celebrities sporting the HAC bag. Uh, firstly, we have a photo here of Travis Scott with a ostrich HAC bag in tricolor. And I don't know, guys, I have never seen anything like this before. I assume this is extremely rare because uh, not only do you have three colors here, but it's in ostrich and yeah, it's a HAC. So it's not the easiest bag to come by. I feel like a HAC bag um, is sometimes even rarer than a Birkin. Like, I hardly ever see HAC bags around, and I've never seen anyone wear one in real life. I guess it's a popular bag for men because it's proportioned bigger, so if you're a bigger guy, you could probably pull it off. But I've definitely seen women wear it as well, which I'll get to in a sec. But yeah, how crazy is this tricolor HAC? I've also seen Kanye West sport a HAC bag. Here he has an extremely beat up version of one. You can see the hardware is very tarnished and the corners are completely, yeah, worn in. And it almost looks like the body of this bag is different from the top part. Correct me if I'm wrong, guys, but this almost looks to me like it could be suede, but it could even just be like a Berenia leather or something, but it's definitely very well worn in, and you can see that one of the sangles is completely out of the little hole bit as well. I've also got another photo of Travis Scott here with a alligator or crocodile, uh, HAC, in the shiny porosis finish so it's shiny kind of it's almost like a caramel color with palladium hardware I mean this looks extremely bougie but I assume this is something he's going to carry on a private jet or it's just like a flex bag because it's full on crocodile and it's massive and I know that uh, a lot of rappers kind of always wear blinged out uh, jewelry and like really elaborate accessories and I think that's why Pharrell invented like the millionaire speedy because it's such like a showy uh, flex <laughs> of a bag you know it's full-on crocodile it's got the parve diamond um, lock and like the chain and this has given me a similar vibe like it's just this massive crocodile bag it's a big flex and yes it screams I'm rich so there's that bag as well. However, if you look at it on uh, Mary-Kate and Ashley Olsen, I don't think they're wearing it in like that much of a showy way. Similar to Kanye, they've got more of a older, beat up looking HAC, which I'm not sure if they share this bag. Maybe they use it as like a carry-on luggage or something. But uh, here, 
I can't tell if it's Mary Kate or Ashley because they've got their glasses on, but they've got a a big black one with gold hardware. And you can see this has definitely been worn in quite a lot as well. And perhaps they picked this up pre-loved. I mean, I'm sure they probably did. And isn't it cute how she's also carrying a little Chanel GST in blue? I just think that that combination is quite random, but it's pretty cool as well. And, you know, they've been spotted wearing this bag a few times and yeah I'm it looks like to me like a bit of a a carry-on travel bag um, I've also seen the HAC on here we go uh, for Rel he's got it in alligator as well and I feel like he probably has a few quite a few Hermes bags but here it looks like it's in like a purple color with gold hardware which what an incredible combination and the crocodile very bougie to look at, that's for sure. And um, yeah, I imagine it would be very heavy as well. And here we have an ostrich one, a HAC on Chrissy Teigen, which I have no idea who she is, but I just found this image on Google and a paparazzi shot of her with this HAC. Seems like she's just wearing it out casually and it actually doesn't look too crazy. Like I always think like if a bag is too big, it almost looks like comical on a person but in this case maybe because it's a neutral color she's pulling it off and it definitely ties into like her tiger print boots as well so kind of looks cool in this case and we also have a more modern day photo of Kendall Jenner sporting the HAC in black with gold hardware as well she's definitely fashioned this in a similar way to the Olsen twins like more vintage vibe beat up just like a carry-on thing not sure where Kendall Jenner is going but it looks like she could be going to like the airport or something in a bag like this like it is extremely massive to just carry out like shopping or for every day but it is comically big um even though she's really tall like it just looks massive on her so yeah I do wonder if a bag like this would ever become more mainstream and we'll see more people out and about wearing massive bags like this like it's definitely almost like a flex or a fashion statement I think the way Mary Kate and Ashley wore it was more of like in a travel like a chic travel bag but the way I see other people wearing it it's more to just like I don't know kind of it seems a little bit unnecessarily big but yeah let me know what you think as well we also have a, a red HAC on Katie Holmes and she's been seen wearing this I think um, as a travel bag so she wore this more as a travel bag I think this is quite an old photo maybe from like 2008 or so but yeah definitely in the color red it's making quite a statement and it looks comically big compared to her body but I think as a travel bag like think of it as like a Louis Vuitton keep or something it makes sense when in context but as an everyday bag it's like um it's enormous and you've also got here a HAC on Kim Kardashian and hers is definitely more of a flex I don't think she's going to the airport or anything and it's a particular flex because she's got a hand-painted uh painting on the bag of these naked ladies and I think it's pretty cool when people paint designer bags if they have like a floor on them or something like I've seen people paint on bags that have a stain on them or they've got like you know Irreplaced, irreparable damage that looks really ugly so they'll paint on the bag but I definitely think it became a trend as well to paint onto d designer bags and a lot of wealthy people um, actually paint on their designer bags as like I don't know I feel like it's a little bit of a show-off thing as well like look how much money I have I'm just gonna paint on my own expensive bag but in this case who knows maybe this HAC had like a big stain on the front and this was like a cover-up painting but yeah um very interesting uh painting there looks a little bit abstract um yeah but that's definitely a statement bag as well so guys what do you think of the HAC bag I think I'm gonna do a part two of this video because uh, there's other pictures that I found online that I really want to go into depth and talk about but I think I'm just gonna talk about the HAC today so st stay tuned for part two of this video I'm gonna talk about more celebrity pics that I've found on Google and yes uh, please like and subscribe to my channel let me know guys do you own a HAC or would you buy one I think I would buy a HAC in the size 28 which I think you can get uh, vintage ones of those or I'd wear the HAC backpack uh, which is a men's backpack that I really like the look of but in terms of the bigger HACs um, yeah I don't know if I would ever use one maybe I would use one as an ornament in my house but it's definitely a statement bag 
Uh, so anyways, yeah, thanks for watching again. Like and subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys on my next one. Bye!